Hey guys, this is Kamal from Nokia Views and today I am going to show you a really cool way to block ads on your Windows 10 mobile device. Um, the best way to do it, it would have been, you know, uh, using an ad blocker. But since Microsoft is nowhere going to, you know, release an ad blocker for the Microsoft Edge, uh, we had to find a different way to do it. And thanks to a Reddit post that I went through today, there is a way to plug ads. So uh, here's what you need to do. This is running Windows 10 Mobile RS2 Redstone 2 build. So you go to settings. Now go to network and wireless. Go to Wi-Fi legacy. Uh, we'll be making use of proxy here. Yeah. And right now in RS2, if you go to normal Wi-Fi, you won't find options for the proxy settings. That is why Microsoft is including them in the legacy part here. So here, here I am connected to my Wi-Fi router. Now you will need to click on use setup script here. If previously by default it is set to none you use the click on the use setup script and then enter this script URL basically this is a PAC file and it contains lists of all the uh, you know the settings and all that shit. I don't want to get into technical jargon here, but it basically kills the ads. And you just write, type down the script address here, and then click on the, tap on this uh, tick button here to save the settings. And voila! Uh, try opening a site. I I opened the my own website here, and saw that no Google ads were appearing, whatsoever. So pretty cool stuff, no ads, nothing. Now there are obviously some of the disadvantages which might be advantages to, you know, people like you. For instance, there will be no ads in the games that games and applications that show ads. So it might benefit you, but in the long term it will, you know, harm the app developers. Um, that's it for now and uh, I have not tried it on my Windows phone. 8.1 phone um, but I, I don't see no reason why it should not work I mean it is pretty straightforward you enter the URL here and tap on the take button and it works on Android and iPhone as well so this is a great hack mm, and if this script doesn't work in the future future you can just search the web for PAC uh, dot js files on google and you know update this file with the with an updated url so that's it for now if you found found this video useful give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to this channel for more windows 10 mobile and windows phone 8.1 tips that was a mouthful bye bye and take care